You A. Own your own business. B. Live in Washington, D.C. And C. Need to travel to San Francisco for a business meeting. Since you are in control, you decide how to travel from Washington, D.C. to San Francisco. For example, you could travel by car. Driving 300 miles in direct route gives you a business day. Say you drive 300 miles, stop, play golf, stay overnight. Presto, business day. For that business day, you deduct breakfast, lunch, dinner, snacks, and lodging. Wow, nice. Eight days of this, and you arrive in San Francisco. No deduction for the golf, sorry. But let's do this. Add your family to the car. This has zero effect on your car deductions. You are still at 100%. Lodging should be pretty much the same, perhaps a little additional. Meals for your spouse and children are not deductible, but most everything else is. What about a one-day side trip to the Grand Canyon? No problem. Now you have a nine-day trip. Eight business days, one personal day. What if you don't like to drive? No problem. Fly. You can fly coach, business class, or even first class. In all cases, you deduct 100% of your transportation cost as a business expense. You can even fly your own plane. No problem. Still 100% deductible. How about the train? The scheduled train from Washington, D.C. to San Francisco is about three days. That's the schedule, but this is a U.S. train. It often takes four days. But since you are taking this business train trip for the sightseeing side benefit, the train schedule is not critical, albeit you should plan one extra tax-deductible business day and night in San Francisco to accommodate the high possibility of a train delay. You have one other way to travel from Washington, D.C. to San Francisco. What is it? It's by ship. Yes, the ship is allowed. It's subject to what are called the luxury water limits, which means your daily tax deductions are limited. Depending on the month, the tax code will limit your luxury water deductions to anywhere from $700 to $900 a day. Your tax deductions apply to the most direct route. From Washington, D.C. to San Francisco, your most direct route is through the Panama Canal. This is about a 10-day trip, meaning your luxury water travel deductions are limited to somewhere between $7,000 and $9,000 for the trip from Washington, D.C. to San Francisco. For tax code citations that show you the proof of why this works, see our tax strategy article titled How to Deduct Travel by Car, Train, Plane, or Boat. Click the link below to find the article.